guys. Um, I am going to hack my face. Give me one second so that I can share this in my group. Wait for a few people to jump on here. Ooh, that just made me bright. I wonder what lighting is better. I'm gonna have to go back and check. Hi Liz. All right, you know what, I'll just share that later. Okay, so anybody who jumps on late can just watch the replay. So I'm gonna start bare bones basic. My name is Bethany Balsis, I am a mascara artist. Hi Monica. Um, I'm gonna start bare bones basic for anybody who is new and doesn't know. So, hi Rachel. Um, mascara's main, most popular product is what we call um, the 3D foundation. So basically the thought process behind it, hi Darlena, is, I'm um, sorry, I'm getting text messages, um, that our face is three dimensional. Our face is not one dimensional. So when we're using like a traditional liquid foundation, you're putting, you're putting one color all over your face, giving you kind of like a flat look. Hi Darlena. <laughs> um, so when you're doing a 3D foundation, you're shading the areas of your face that should be shaded with what we call contour and highlighting the areas of your face that should be highlighted, um, giving your face a three dimensional look. So a basic place to start for girls is with what we call a quad compact. So this is a quad compact. This is our marble compact. Um, we have five different um, print options, um, although I think sea glass may be out. Hi, Allison. So um, you would start with a quad compact, and you can upgrade your compact to a larger compact if, if you want to add eyeshadows and stuff like that. So this is the quad compact. It has a mirror, and this right here is magnetic. So you would start with four colors. You get color matched for a highlight, a contour, a cheek color, and an illuminator, and they come in these super adorable little tins. I don't know if this is upside down. Yeah, that's upside down. So I'm gonna start, I'm gonna set up my quad. So I'm gonna start with my lighter shade. So I use two highlight colors because I want extra brightening underneath my eyes. Oh, you guys, first, before I start this, share this video and I am doing a giveaway for anybody who shares this video me hide my gray anybody who shares this video um, will go into a drawing for free tins so you will be getting a free quad with four free tins so if you're new to mascara you've never used mascara um, we will get you color matched and get you your colors and you'll get your makeup for free if you're an existing customer that wins then you can pick any four colors that you want you can add blushes powders whatever okay so I'm gonna set up my quad so I'm gonna go, I'm gonna start with my lighter highlight. I'm gonna slide her off. It's magnetic. And I literally, I'm just going to, gosh, pop her in there. So that color is June. That's what I've been using underneath my eyes. Then we're gonna go in with amber. I took it out, slid the top off. Amber, next. My contour color, which is olive. Going to pop that right into my compact. And then my favorite cheek color, which is black cherry, which is so scary to so many people because it's so dark, but you guys, it is so beautiful on everybody. So I'm gonna show you black cherry. So there we go. So I have a dual highlight in here. I don't have my illuminator in here right now because I use a dual highlight. So in, in this situation, I would just keep my illuminator in my makeup bag because that is what you use the least and that's what you use last um, until you're ready to upgrade your compact. So once you're ready to upgrade your compact or if you decide to upgrade your compact in the beginning, you might possibly go to what we call a hack stack. So this is another print, and you open it here, you would have the same four things on top, and then 
four things on bottom. So can you see? It's two of the quads on top of each other. So you would have room for eight tins. So in that case, you would have room for all the things. So that compact is free when you buy eight different tins. So you could get a dual highlight, a dual highlight, a contour, maybe two cheek colors, so that would be five, an illuminator and two eyeshadows, and you would get that for free and you would be able to fit all of the things. Okay, so I'm gonna start by hacking my face. So I am going to use our two main brushes for highlighting and contouring are the 30 second hack brush and the detail hack brush, and you can see the differences between the two. I use both of them for different things and I'll go over that. Um, some people use, I mean, it's just personal preference. So I am going to take the pointed end of the 30 second hack and I'm literally just going to tap it into June, which is my lighter color. And I'm gonna come in underneath my eye and I'm gonna try not to poke myself in the eye. And I'm gonna come in a pie piece down underneath my eye. So the key here, you guys, is light hand. If you put too much on, you're gonna look cakey, you're gonna feel heavy, and you're gonna hate it. And also, if you have been color matched and you feel like it's not going on like butter, then you probably have a wrong color. So that's a problem and we need to get that fixed. Okay, just dabbing, going in on the other side. Sorry, I gotta look at my mirror. Coming in down underneath my eye, pie piece, and then pulling that out. Okay, so you can see the coverage here already. Now I'm going to go into my darker highlight color, which for me is amber, and I'm going to put that along my jawline, see if I can see here in the phone. See how that's covering up my redness, you guys? Oh my goodness. Okay, hang on a second. You guys. Is this, does that look better or worse to you guys? Can you tell the difference? It's like this little flash thing. To me, this looks super grayed out and this looks super bright. Which one looks better? Someone tell me. And if you're here watching, Oh, it looks better? Okay. I don't even know what that is, but we're going to go with it. So you want to go on with a stippling motion. And if you're here watching me, drop a comment and tell me where you're from. Don't forget to share the video to be entered into the giveaway. for a free um, quad, four tins. Okay, so I'm gonna go into amber, my same color. I only use June, the lighter color, underneath my eyes. I feel like I can't see as well. Okay, so there's my highlight. So I use the detail hack for my contour. So I'm gonna drag the tip of it you guys see, sorry. I drag the tip of it, just the very tippy side, into my contour, and I need to use my mirror for this. So you're gonna feel where your cheekbone is, and you're gonna come at the very base of your cheekbone. And when I'm using this brush, I just lightly drag it down like that, and you're gonna kinda curve up on the end, and then you're gonna pull that up. So basically you want to feel like you're chiseling out your cheekbone, literally. You guys see that? Yeah, you can see that. 
And the biggest thing is you always want to go up with your contour. You never want to go you never want to go down. You want to raise the cheekbones, not lower them. Okay. Looking cute. This is so hard for me on this side because my left hand is literally stupid. So I got to do it with my right hand. I look a little ghostly. Okay, then I'm just going to take the tip of it. I'm going to pull it around my forehead. Contour my jawline just a little bit on the tip of my chin here. And then I'm going to take the same side and run it down the side of my nose like this to contour my nose. And then the tip. Can we do it all with only one brush? You can. So if you have the 30 second hack, you can use this end for your highlight, this end for your contour. I've, I do both. I just tend to prefer the detail hack um, for contouring. So you could also use this end for your highlight, this end for your contour, or you could use this for your highlight, this for your contour. Like everybody does it differently. And I find girls who have smaller faces tend to prefer this brush um, in general overall. I've never even used this for my highlight, but I do want to try it. Um, I use this end for my highlight because I have a big face. A big face. Um, so you'll just have to see what you feel like works for you, but probably you're going to end up wanting um, more than one brush. Just saying. Hi, Ashley. Okay. So now I have my highlight and my contour on. I'm going to take my perfector sponge. I've already got it wet. It's, um, here, let me show you. So here's a dry sponge. Here's a wet sponge. Can you see the difference when it's wet, you guys? You want to make sure it's wet and totally wrung out like in a towel. And you're just going to come in and you're going to dab. Dab, 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 dab. To blend everything. So you guys, today is mascara's first birthday. One year since the day that they launched and opened. Hello, Ashley. Wisconsin. Wisconsin in the house. One year from the date that they opened up enrollment to artists. So we um, have a bunch of craziness and promotions and stuff going on today. Why does my hair look flat? And it's been a crazy morning. Um, see my new tattoo? What? what? Um, okay, so we got that blended. I need to stay focused. We, we have that blended. So now we're going to go in with, normally I would go in and like more define my contour, but for the sake of time. Okay, so I'm going to grab my B squared brush. So this is what I use for my blush. Going into black cherry. Apples of the cheeks on the outside of the iris. Oh God, I love this color. Okay. So that's black cherry. Does that seem like what you guys would have thought based on that dark? Oh, I just put my hand in my contour that dark of a color. It is so, I love it. It looks so good on everybody. Hi, Joy! And when people see it, they're like, I'm scared of that! Do not put that on my face. And then you put it on and they're like, obsessed. Okay, I'm missing my multitasker brush. So I'm literally just gonna take my finger, which is what I usually like to put my lips on. I'm just gonna take my finger and put some of that color on my lips. The cheek color doubles as a lip. Okay, so that's black cherry. Um, 
Okay, wipes. I gotta clean my hand. All right, if you guys are just joining, make sure you share this video. I am giving away four free tins. If you're new to mascara or have never ordered before, we can color match you and get you your quad for free, which would be this with your four colors, your four colors that are color matched. If you're an existing customer, you can pick any four colors that you want. Okay, so now I am going to do my illuminator. So one of the um, promotions that we have going on today for, hi Melissa, Christy, for anybody, Jen, for anybody that signs up to be an artist, you guys, I need to get my hair colored. For anybody that signs up to be an artist today, they get a free artist palette, which is amazing. So let me just show you the difference in the size. So this is the little quad. It fits like four of these. Yes, Sarah. I know. I just saw your message, too. So I got to message you. Black Cherry is so... Oh, I love it. Okay, so here's the artist palette. So these are highlights. These are contours across the bottom. It's a triple decker, you guys. This is free today for any new artists that join our team. This is my sideways... <laughs> These are all blushes on the top. These are illuminators across the bottom. Eyeshadows. And then these are powders. This is the Vanilla Dust Setting Powder. And these are the Cayman Bronzers, which I stick to in my compact so that when I use my bronzing end, I can literally just plop, because see how big and fluffy it is? It's amazing. So I can just plop it in there. And then it comes with a pop socket to hold on the back. See? Um, so this is free. It's a $70 value. I had to pay $70 for this. This is free for anyone who joins our team today. I think I've already had five or six girls that have signed up. A couple of my other girls have had girls. It's going to be a crazy party, you guys. Join the tribe. Um, everybody needs to know about mascara. Um, okay, so then the other thing is, um, let me just tell you the other incentives that are happening. Um, for the basic kit, Kara, the founder of Mascara, She's sort of up the ante. Um, with the basic kit, you will also be getting um, a jar of milk, which is our moisturizer. And I don't think I have one sitting here. So you will also be getting a jar of milk with the, with the basic kit. So the basic kit is $199. Um, for 400 and some dollars worth of makeup, you're going to get the artist palette for free. So that is $70. And then you're going to get the milk moisturizer, which is 50 bucks. You guys, so that's um, $120 worth of free stuff with your basic kit. That basically means you're getting your kit for 80 bucks. That's so crazy. Then the pro kit, sorry, am I yelling? See, I get a little too excited. Um, the pro kit is $399 and you will get the artist palette for free and you'll get the entire skincare system, the entire Trace Leche system, which um, it, the pro kit already includes the milk moisture, but you'll be getting the milk cleanser, which is actually this I have sitting right here, and the toner, which I don't have sitting right here, but you'll be getting that also in your kit, which is not something that you normally get. Okay, so let's do some illuminator. So I like to take my Perfector sponge, um, and actually I've been doing something different. So usually I'll take my Perfector sponge, just swipe it through my illuminator and put it on. Lately, I've been using the Power Powder Brush just because um, this is what I use this end right here. Can you see that? I take that to my Vanilla Dust and I pat it on my eyes before I put my eyes. So right now I'm wearing Bubba. Um, mostly Bubba is what, you, which is what you see right there. And you guys, I'm like eyeshadow stupid. I have no idea. <gasps> Hi, Rachel. Hi, Crystal. Um... Okay, so I'm going to take this other end of the Power Powder Brush, and I'm going to dab it into my Rose Gold Illuminator. I'm just going to put her on here. I feel like I like the application with the brush. Okay, so can you see that? Maybe I should do Honey so you can see the difference in the shimmer the glow. See the glow right there? Okay. Can you see the glow, you guys? So we have like two flakes of snow on the ground today. 
So schools are canceled. So hopefully my oldest is downstairs keeping my kids. So I go up the bridge of my nose, go here on the cupid's bow, up here, which I already did on my brows. Um, yeah, so there's that. Okay, what else do we need to talk about, you guys? For anybody that just joined, share this video. I'm giving away a free quad today filled with four colors, which is what you need, Rachel. Um, so if any, if you're new to mascara, you will be getting a free quad if you win the giveaway, if you share the video. And if you are an existing customer for mascara, you can pick four, four colors, whatever four colors you want. So let me show you guys a couple of the other compacts. I showed you the pink one, right? Here's this. Sometimes it's hard to see. I feel like on the website, so I want to show you in person. Here's this. What you guys doing today? Here's the other um, one. And where is my... Oh, my seed last one is downstairs in my bag, you guys. Oh, wait, here. So this is sea glass C. I think the quad is sold out in this, but that's sea glass. Okay. So I think that's it. What am I forgetting? Anybody have any questions? Come here to talk to me. What questions do you have? Jen, are you on? Am I, what am I forgetting? Hmm? Peoples. Tell me what I'm forgetting. Okay, well, I'm gonna hop off. I have to go run an errand. And um, yeah, so I went over the artist incentives for today. Oh, let's spray with some stay spray. So this is our stay spray. So when I'm done, stay. Most amazing stay product ever. So when I get out of the shower in the morning, I spray my face with stay spray. Um, and that kind of works as my primer. I don't use moisturizer in the morning. And honestly, you guys, so I have oily skin. This stuff stays on my face all day. I haven't baked, which I usually do bake. I'll bake real, I'll bake real quick. Um, so here, let me show you what I use. This is from Too Faced, Peach Perfect. It's delicious. It literally, <coughs> I'm laughing. <coughs> Let me die real quick. I take my wet perfector sponge. So if you're an oily girl, this is something you might wanna do. Or in the beginning, while your skin is adjusting to your cream foundation, and if you feel like, look at I'm killing myself. If you feel like um, things feel, you know, like, if you're doing the right application, you're not using too much and you're still feeling like you're just a little oilier than you would like, then try to bake. So I take my wet perfector sponge, dip her in here, do this. I usually do this before my blush. Oh my gosh, this smells so good. I like want to eat it. And then I take B squared. I usually let this sit. B squared, swipe her off. Usually want to let it sit for a few minutes at least. And then, so that I just put on my highlight areas. And then I go in on my contour areas with my bronzing powder. You guys, seriously, like, if I can do this, anybody can do this. So that's that, all right? All right, just a reminder, share this video to be entered into a giveaway for a free quad. That's four free tins. And if you have any other questions, I'll be answering them below. Otherwise, have a good day.